Hello everybody, welcome back to Being the Odds. It is Friday, January 26, 2024. We are back with our NBA best bets of the day. If you're new to the channel, my name is Zach and welcome to Being the Odds. Hit that subscribe button, like this video, and notification bell so you never miss a pick. We post these NBA videos every single day along with the NFL, NHL, and college basketball. We're also coming up big winning years in college football and the MLB as well. Uh, we're going after our first 15,000 subscribers, our first year on YouTube. Really excited to have y'all here. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. So to recap yesterday's results, we had another great day. 3-0 yesterday. We're on an 11-1 NBA run. Uh, where our members only play was the Kings money line, not the spread, the money line. Thank God we did money line, not minus one and a half. That was a winner. Celtics minus seven, never a doubt. And the Pacers plus five blew out the 76ers on a letdown spot. We saw it coming from a mile away. Overall for the year, 177 and 127, crushing this NBA season so far, 50 games over 500. And we have three plays today in the NBA. I might be adding more here. Um, we do have those three plays, and we have two of those here on YouTube, and we have a members only play as well today that I freaking love in the NBA. And when I say love it, I mean love it. Plus one in college basketball. You can visit zdmbets.com slash picks, the website linked in the comments below. But let's get into the plays that we have today. I'm gonna start with our first play, which is gonna be the over 241 in Oklahoma City and New Orleans. Neither of these teams can neither of these teams can guard the other. The the um the Pelicans don't have an answer for SGA. They just don't. Um, as far as on the guard side, I think SGA can score 35, 40 points in this game. Um, you look at Chet, I don't really think that jo because of how Chet plays, Jonas is not going to be a good defensive matchup for him. You're going to have to put Zion on him, but Zion's not that good of a defender. Like Brandon Ingram's going to have to guard Jalen Williams. I don't really see how that's going to go. I don't see how that's going to go well at all um, for, for them. And then when you flip it on the other side, I mean, like CJ McCollum, not really much of a matchup for him. Same thing with Brandon Ingram, um, and same thing with Jonas and, um, and, and Zion. So I love the over 241. Both these teams very, very fast paced, especially Oklahoma City. Um, Roll with the over 241 here, Oklahoma City and New Orleans. And they're doing the Magic minus five versus the Grizzlies. Um, without Jaw, this Grizzly team is absolutely fucking terrible. Like, they're they are absolutely a horrendous, horrendous basketball team. The Magic are very underrated. They had a hot start, kind of cooled down. But I think they're actually, like, a pretty good team. I'm not saying they're – they're like an eight seed in, in the East. You have kind of an idea. That's kind of how I think about it. The sharp money, though, today is heavy on the Magic. I like the Magic here minus five on the road. I would never bet a bad team on the road like that, um, you know, giving points, but they're playing an even worse team than the Grizzlies who have absolutely no hope. I rolled the Magic here minus five uh, versus the Grizzlies. Grizzlies with no hope, meaning without job. Now, I might post a sim game parlay later, that sort of thing. Check my Twitter for that. My Twitter is linked in the description below. Um, but a quick recap what we have. We have the over 241 Oklahoma City New Orleans, and we have the Magic minus five versus the Grizz. So let's go lock in those picks. Let's go win together today. Let's go make some money. I'll see you all tomorrow. Make sure you all check those other videos.